Good evening. Good evening. Yes, there. Can you hear me? Hello, teacher. Oh, hello, Carla. How are you? I'm fine. I'm glad to hear that. Okay. What about the others? Hello, Katie. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Uh, I'm doing well. Thanks, God. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Um, how was your day today? Sorry. How was your day today? It was great. Today was my my first day after vacation, so. Oh. Okay. So a little bit to getting used to the new routine. <laughs> exactly. Ah, I I'm see. Happy to be back. Sorry. I'm happy to be back. Yeah, well, we're happy to have you. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, well, well, to have you back into, <laughs> into the, into the um, corporation, right? Because I think, I, I think they probably missed you. <laughs> right? Um, by the way, I, since, let me tell you something. I, I, I always think of you every day because we Every day I have to send a production report. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening, Marvin. Okay. <laughs> okay, yes. Okay, so forever you will be, you will remember Miss uh, <laughs> Jessica Herrero with the production report. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh my, yeah, well, you know, sometimes that happens. I, I actually remember one of my teachers um, because I, I don't know if I, I don't know if I've ever told you this story, but this is this is the reason why I know for for a fact that doing those activities of, you know, um, you know, even if you if you if you feel a little funny doing it, like the, doing those activities are like, uh, doing something physical with your body, it works. And it's because my sixth grade teacher, so imagine sixth grade teacher, I'm talking about, I was like 10 years old. Okay. So yeah. So it's a long time ago, right? <laughs> and this is my 10 year old, the, my, 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 um, sorry, my sixth grade teacher was teaching us how to um, spell the word because. Good evening. Good evening, Jerry. And he noticed that the majority of the class was misspelling the word because. So what he did was he taught us and he said, okay, you have to, you have to sing the song. You have to say B-E-C-A-U-S-E. -E. <laughs> and I guess, you know, he was, it was because like the majority of were spelling, they probably were forgetting the A and the U. So mm -hmm. they were, he wanted to emphasize that part. Mm -hmm. And he said, B E C A U S E. <laughs> and I still remember that. I mean, like years later, almost two decades, well, no, what? Almost three decades later. And I still remember it. Mm -hmm. I remember it. I, I, it. It's like right there in my head. And so that's what I'm saying. I know this works because it, it has helped me. Yes, exactly. yeah. <laughs> and and like they say in Spanish, I did not have problems spelling that word. I didn't have problems, <laughs> but I just remembered. I remember the, the song or that, you know, the way that he, he used to teach us. So, you know, <laughs> that's why I know it will work and you will remember the production. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I promise you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I will remember the product. I was also explaining to my co-workers today and they were laughing a lot, but, but I said, yes, we use that word a lot and we need to pronounce it very well. <laughs> yeah, uh, I know, uh, I know. Okay, well, anyways, guys, welcome. I'm happy to see you guys the last day of the week. Yay! All right, it's the weekend. Our 
Do we have anything fun planned for the weekend? No? No. Nothing, nothing interesting, nothing fun? Not at all? Oh. I will play. play. Marvin, we couldn't hear you very well. At least I couldn't hear you very well. Mm -mm. Could you repeat? I that? will uh, play playing basketball. Oh, okay, that sounds interesting. Like, is nice. it like a, a basketball court near your house? Something like that. Uh, please, please. Is it a basketball court near your house, or? Or like a tournament that you're gonna go to? No. Uh, uh, when, what? What is it? The word? A, a basketball court. Court. Oh, First time I heard that. Court. Court. C O U R T. Uh, excuse yeah. me. I uh, I don't. Mm, er, okay. I've, ri I've written it in well, the chat. Uh, uh -huh. Basketball court. And is that a game, a local Connect. game, or what? Actually, no. It's very... No. Okay, but base. Uh, let's say, like, okay, soccer. You play soccer where? Where do you play soccer? Ay, cómo se dice cancha. Ay, no sé cómo se dice cancha. En la cancha, guys. <laughs> que le guste no, el Ay, Dios. <laughs> you don't know how to say soccer so soccer play soccer. soccer no the la cancha la cancha la cancha de fútbol en English no no okay all right okay. ah Field teacher. Field. 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 Very field. good. Okay, good. Excellent. So we have a soccer field. Okay? Ah. A soccer field. And that soccer field is, or better said, a field is used for big games like um, and games where you have to play a, like, um, it's very like a, a very big space. Um, but you can run a lot. Where you can run a lot exactly so uh, soccer field we have a baseball field baseball field uh we can have a football field which is not the same as un, no, no es una cancha de fútbol es una cancha de fútbol americano right so football football field uh we can have mm -hmm. um well pretty much those are the ones okay now those like i said are big spaces big 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 spaces mm -hmm. and you can run you know they usually have like grass and things like that but when it's a small play space like um for playing um basketball for playing tennis for playing um, floor hockey, floor hockey, mm -hmm. not ice hockey, floor hockey. Um, yeah, pretty much those. So, okay, so we can have, so we have a basketball court, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, hockey, or better said a floor hockey court. We can have um, a tennis court. Okay. And basically, they are smaller spaces, and it, they're made of usually like uh, wood or cement, right? Okay, so okay, it's, okay? so the end is smaller. Okay, so that's a court. So what I was okay. asking Marvin was, do you, are you going to play on a basketball court that is near your house? Yes, yes, teacher. Okay. okay. <laughs> oh, oh, see. <laughs> First time I heard that court. Oh. Didn't know nothing about okay. it. Well, Good me, to me know. Too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Now you guys know the difference. Okay. All Thank right, you. guys. Yeah, you're welcome. Well, guys, um, we're going to begin 
with our, um, what's it called? Attendance. Okay, mm -hmm. so let's try, let's do that. Give me a moment while I get the attendance out. Tengo tantas ventanas abiertas, no me recuerdo dónde la abrí. <laughs> Give me a moment. My goodness, I... Ah, okay, got it. Now I did it. Okay, uh, Ana Claudia? Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Andrés? <clears throat> Andrés? All right, Edgar. Present teacher. Welcome, Edgar. Janet. Janet? Oh, Janet. Okay. Uh, Fabiola? Present teacher. All right, welcome. Fabiola, eh, me colabora ahí con su camarita. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> me, me encantó la, esa. Eh, Ese, esa, ¿cómo se llama? Ese tono tan así como obediente. Ok, no sé, como, ni modo. Ok, thank you very much, I appreciate it. Es, no, no lo haría si, si, si no fuera algo que requisito. Ok, but I'm sorry. I have to, I have to ask for it. Um, Heidi. Present teacher. Ok, Irene. Irene. Uh, Ivan. Ivan, Ivan, no. Okay, um, Johnny. Johnny? Johnny, Johnny? No, no Johnny. Uh, Josue? Josue? Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Uh, Juan Francisco. Yes, and teacher. Welcome. Yes, and teacher. Okay, all right, gotcha. All right. Um, Jerry. Present teacher. Welcome. Carla. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlita, también me podría colaborar ahí con Samarita. Really okay, happy. teacher, okay. Thank you, thank you very much. Okay, uh, Melissa, not here, right? Hi, uh, Luis? Present teacher. Okay, uh, welcome, Manuel. <clears throat> Manuel, 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 no, okay. Uh, Marvin? Present teacher. Okay, uh, Werner? Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Wendy? Mm, present teacher. Welcome, Wendy. Uh, Francisco? Francisco? No. Okay. Uh, Jenny? Jenny? No. Okay. All right. Uh, let me just make sure I have everybody. Um, I didn't hear Andres, Janet, Irene. Irene. Oh, okay. There she is. Okay. Welcome. Um, Ivan, Johnny. Um, Melissa, Manuel, Francisco, Javier, and Jen. Okay, all right. Teacher, did you call me? Sorry. I'm sorry about that, Yvonne. Qué bonito, su acompañante. <laughs> <laughs> ya lo vimos. Oh, el compañero de clase. <laughs> He's the space dog. <laughs> yes. It looks like the space dog with the background. Uh-huh. 
Okay, all right. He knows, he knows some words. Really? He can say, yeah, he can say one. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what? This is the first time I hear a dog speak. Okay, now yeah. I get it. You can okay. say one. One, uh -huh. very good. <laughs> okay, <laughs> all right, guys. Welcome to today's class. Thank you, everybody, uh, for being here on time. Uh, antes que nada, quiero asegurarme, todos ya tienen los documentos. Completos de su trabajo, ya, ya hablaron con su trabajo, está todo en orden. Yes? Sí, sí, en mi trabajo sí ya, lo, ya los mandaron, solo me dijeron que le preguntara a Jonathan, pero me imagino que mañana me va a contestar porque le mandé mensaje y no. Pero sí, ya me confirmaron. Pues. Ok, ok. But anybody is having any problems with the documents, please tell me right now so we can help you before it's too late. Si no nos vamos atrasando, acuérdense si, si después, eh, después ustedes no pueden, um, ¿cómo se llama? No pueden eh, mandarlo a tiempo, después nos atrasamos. So, I just want to make sure. Anybody have, is having problems with the documents? No. Okay, good. Now, the other so second thing I want to tell you, and um, I'm going to remind you at the end of the class, but I'm going to remind you right now too, just in case somebody disconnects before. Today is Friday, and today on Fridays are, remember, we are the last days that we um, have to complete the homework of the week. So that means that tomorrow I have to upload the grades. First thing at eight o'clock, that's what I do, okay? So I need everybody to have it ready before eight o'clock or better said tonight. Para hacerlo más, porque no creo que van a estar haciéndolo bien tempranito mañana ni van a estar madrugando. Okay, so, um, so I needed to have it tonight. I wanna make sure that everybody finishes um, all of the exercises for this week. Any problems so far? No? Okay, good. All right, good. And um, what was the other thing I was going to say? Uh, and remember that uh, also you can start with the final, the, the final exam. Like you don't have to wait till the last minute. You don't have to wait until next weekend to do it. You can start from now, you can start go advance, like um, going a little bit ahead so that you can, um, so you don't have to worry so much about it later, okay? So, es, mi sugerencia siempre eso, vayan como altilla, ¿verdad? Como quien dice, eh, un, tal tema que se vio, uh, mejor ya adelanten ahí de una sola vez con lo, lo que está de ese tema en el examen final para que ya de, de una sola vez se vea eso. Eh, y así porque, ah, ojo con esto. No van a poder pasar si no completan el final exam. Porque el final exam es la ponderación más alta. Entonces, imposible pasar si usted no termina el final. So, please, 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 make sure you complete the final exam. ¿Ok? O sea, pueden tener 100 en todo lo demás, pero si el final exam no está, I'm sorry, no, no, no les va a dar la nota. Okay. Teacher, yes. I, have a, I have a question. Yesterday you were talking about the problem that, well, I don't know if it is a problem, but I when I try to resolve the task, uh, I am writing a memo right now. I I have a I have a error even that I try to write. Yeah. I don't know what is the error in that. Okay. I, I'm still I'm still confused. What is the I, I've heard about this error, but I don't exactly understand what it is. So if you guys could tell me, I can help you. What, what is the problem? So which which one which exercise is it? In the sentences is I am writing a memo right now. No, no, if no. I, Sorry, I mean like what is the what exercise is it? What 
what, what, what is the task what, number 13? The homework number 13. 13. Number 13, that's right. But yesterday, Yvonne uh, gave me the resolution because I found the two. And uh, she said that there are two mistakes. Yvonne, are you there? So you can explain. OK. Uh, yes. Um, is, is the exercise, um, no, the sentence number two in the mm -hmm. one word uh, 13? Uh, Usually, you only have uh, one mistake in every in every sentence, but in that sentence, you have two mistakes. Uh, one mistake is um, a word that is misspelled. Wrong. Yeah, yeah, misspelled. And the the other mistake is, I think, is the time expression, mm -hmm. because uh, you said yesterday that. The present progressive is about of going situation. So, uh, it, it's situation that is is not happens in in this moment, right now. So the time expression is the is the clue in that exercise. Yes. Yes. That Thank is you so perfect. much. Yes. So the the basically. <laughs> I'm gonna explain something. I resolve. <laughs> thank you, thank oh. you for, for giving me a copy again. <laughs> okay, okay, so, uh, yeah. Entendió el lenguaje figurado. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Así yeah. me pasa a mí ayer cuando iba a me explicar. Ah. Okay, but just to make sure that everybody understands it, because I'm sure I'm gonna get the same question from at least one person. So, the word right now, that's like in immediately in this moment, okay? So yes, we've been talking about the fact that um, that the present progressive is used mostly for, oh, sorry, no, sorry, not mostly, but in some cases used to talk about things that are ongoing, right? So, but not necessarily in this particular moment. And right now kind of gives that idea. So um, we would just, just if you eliminate the right, you should be okay. So yes, so change the, the, the spelling, right? The spelling, there's a mistake with the spelling and just eliminate the word right, which makes it like immediately in this moment. That's it, okay? Any questions? No. Anything else you guys want to ask me before we continue? Uh, teacher, o sea, podemos ya iniciar a, a completar el examen final y no esperar a, a último. Yeah, you can do it from like day number one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right, Heidi? Yes. Heidi exactly. likes to fulfill everything. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that, Heidi. <laughs> the first time I, I, the first week I was like, you know, she's, I was like, oh, she, you got all of it. Yes, uh, yes, exactly. But yes, you, you can actually do that. That from day number one, if you want to start completing the final exam, go ahead. I, now what I can tell you is that you probably are not going to get a hundred percent on the final exam if you do it the first day, because you still have not seen all of the information, but you can sure try. The good thing about the platform is that it doesn't, um, it doesn't uh, subtract any, any points if you get it wrong the first time and you try to try it again. If, so that's not a problem, right? So you get it wrong, it's okay. You can continue, try it, and then finally you can get 100. So that's, it's no, you don't lose anything. That's a good thing, okay? Okay. So guys, what we're gonna do is start here with our presentation. Any, any, any teacher? Yes, okay. Uh, you can you can help help uh, homework uh, thirty. Thirty or thirteen. Thirteen. Oh, okay, good because thirty, I don't think so. <laughs> but no, no, thirty, 13. no. <laughs> <laughs> yes, for thirty, thirteen, yes. Oh, what, what part do you want me to help you with? Um, 
no logro identificar cuál es el error, <ríe> para ser honesto, en la oración. Uh, this, uh, uh, identify the, the mistake and, in each sentence and correct it. Yes. For example, num number uh, sentence number one. Yeah. My boss traveling to Colombia for training about sales. Okay. It is something missing right there. Yeah. Remember, this is the present progressive. And in the present progressive, there is a structure. The structure is subject plus is, are, or am, plus the verb, plus ing, plus the complement. And one of those words, one of those words in number one is missing. So you have to follow the structure. Okay. Okay. Aunque, aunque hay dos, um, to, to bear is in, in progress, traveling is training. No, training is not a verb. Training is a gerund. Oh, okay. 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 But the verb okay. is traveling. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, anything else that you want me to help you with? Aprovechen, aprovechen. Después están en su casita que no hayan que hacer. So right now. Copia, copia, copia ahorita. <laughs> teacher, teacher, ah. excuse me. I don't understand the mistake in the number two. The homework. Uh, uh, Thirsteen, I can hear you uh, good the ex, ex, the uh, uh, the explain to Yvonne. Okay, number two is the one that we just talked about. That um, there are two mistakes. One is a spelling mistake. Yeah, the writing. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. And the other is the time expression. The word right now indicates in this particular moment. And because we are learning that it's not in this particular moment, but around this time, it keeps on going. Okay. So just uh, what I told you was eliminate the right. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay. All right. You're welcome. Anything else? Okay. All right. I'm going to take that as like you um, are finished that you guys or or better said not finished, but um, at least if you're not finished, you understand the exercises. You don't have any questions. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna start then with our PowerPoint. Please tell me if you can see this. Yes, teacher. Yes. Perfect, okay, thank you. All right, so it's beginner module six, it's unit three, it's HR procedures, which is actually their last day with this unit, okay? And today is Friday, June 11, 2021. Stay number 15 and your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. Okay? All right. <clears throat> All right, so yesterday, I asked you to do for homework the following exercise. Write a line paragraph, a line, sorry, a seven line paragraph about the activities you're doing these days. And I said these days, like, so not right now in this particular moment, but around these days. Okay. Use the present progressive, right? So you're going to be using the is, are, or am plus the verb plus ing or negative isn't, aren't, am not, plus verb plus ing. Work in small groups, join your breakout room, share your sentences with your classmates, okay? So right now I'm going to get you to share these sentences 
that you wrote in that those lines you're going to share them with uh, with your classmates um i'm going to get you into groups okay so i i'm going to should get you to work in probably groups of three or four i think that should be a good amount for each group um warner how are you doing are you on two devices warner yes teacher okay okay so we're going to get three or four people in each group and you're going to be sharing i'm going to give you i think I'll give you about 15 minutes because you're going to have like three or three, four people in the group. So it's going to be a lot of speaking. Remember, don't limit yourself to just listening and reading. You know, that's boring. You're not going to learn anything. You're not going to have fun, you know, so just get engaged in the conversation. Okay. So, you know, you listen to your classmates, ask them questions, make comments, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, all in English, of course. Okay, so here we go. Let's open the rooms. Irene, are you having any problems joining? Irene? 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 Irene, are you there? Hello. Okay. Uh, it, it is. I get is it is about us because yes. I in one one of yes. those sentences was about my daughters, but. I don't know if this in this context apply, teacher, or is about me. Because I I create I wrote a sentences about my daughter, but I listen to you that you we are going to write just about us. Yeah. I can listen. <laughs> I can. Me neither. <laughs> well, we all have family, huh? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Okay. Don't worry. Yeah. So anyway, um, the the paragraph was about things that you are doing these days, but okay. if you wrote about your 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 daughter, yeah, it's okay. The important thing is that you, you talk about what she's doing around these days using the present focus. Okay. 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 Um, <coughs> can you share the? I'm going the to sentence begin. If you us, want. Yuri. Okay, I'm going to begin. I am eating pupusas. I am drinking a coffee. Mm -hmm. I am <laughs> studying English all, all night. I am reading a book about alien ways. All night? All night? All night. 
every single day <laughs> all not all night <laughs> because my kids are sleeping my daughter my daughter is playing piano and my daughter is playing soccer excellent okay okay i just wanted to mention a few things jerry mm -hmm. can you read me the first few sentences i am eating pupusas okay and i am i am drinking a coffee okay is is that something you're doing in this moment or like is it regularly frequently okay. no so because this I, is a this is a process a specific moment right eating yeah i would say unless you would say something like i'm eating pupusas on the weekend oh or, or, or friday for example or for instance time. yeah right so that kind of sounds like oh okay so it's something ongoing it continues right frequently yeah. or i am i am drinking coffee in the mornings yeah exactly something like that but i am uh, i am drinking seven seven cup of coffee or every I, day. Am, I, am drinking, <laughs> I am drinking less coffee nowadays mm. that could work that would work a lot or i'm drinking more coffee than usual so that means that it's not just right now but something that is ongoing okay yeah so just make sure yeah. that it sounds like it's something that is ongoing is that something that's going around this time it's not something that happens one time in that particular moment okay 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 mm -hmm. thank you yes okay my sentences are uh i am doing a new project uh, i am doing uh the Close elastic report. I am updating databases. I am learning Excel in daily trainings. I am giving support to maintenance department. <clears throat> uh, I am checking the result of pilot cells. And I am studying English at night. Okay. Oh. You, Marvin Pitt. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I. Improvisation. Uh, Excuse me. Don't worry. <laughs> but it's, it was a joke. <laughs> uh, 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 I don't know. I don't. Uh, I really. I don't. Uh, do much in this day i sleep all day and maybe i going to receive the the certificate oh shoot mm -hmm. uh, yes for, oh, for okay. the, when you use the the, the camera it's, it's shooting it's shot shooting or take a pic uh -huh. when you take a pic it's shot or shooting time <laughs> uh, it's a you, shot the chair it's like, it is like, a, like shot, a shot shoot what is ah uh -huh. ah uh, like a shoot the, mm -hmm. the pistola como disparo yes uh, siempre tenemos la duda que si shot Shoot, shot, que no es para de drink. No. La pronunciación, no, ajá. Yo siempre tenía esa duda. So. What are you guys talking about? Ah? I'm sorry, I'm hmm? very lost. What are you guys talking about? Ah, he's learning <laughs> to uh, photography. So he is explaining uh, us about some pictures he shot. He's, that, he's then explaining I, to us. Ah, he's explaining to us. Uh -huh. <laughs> Okay, and, and my question is, is shot is the past for, I don't know, 
I know, I'm confused. Shot is not related to a drink? How do you pronounce, but how do you yes. pronounce the difference between the verb and, and the noun of the other? The verb is shot too? I was shot, yes, which is a simple past or the past participle. Yeah, I was uh, shot. Uh-huh. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. yeah, so th that's possible to say. Shot, shot when one O is past, right? Sorry? When you write um, shot, but with only one O is in the past. Right. It's the past form. That's part of the yes, exactly. Mm, okay. And in the and the base form is with two O. Yeah. Shoot. Mm -hmm. okay. Ah, that is a pronunciation. I was talking about the Ah. Ah, I saw that shoot was the past. So shoot is the present. Yes. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, well, shoot is the, the, the base form. Mm, okay. Yeah, this is something like okay. Something like now, that. <laughs> okay. We learned something new. Now Warner is <laughs> Warner's turn. Warner. Warner. Are you alive? Is Werner or Warner? No escucha Warner. Warner. <laughs> Werner no se escuchas. No te escuchamos. Um, I guess the key writing. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. A quién? Oh. El micro. El micro. <laughs> El micro bus. Okay. El micro bus. Okay. Okay. No problem. You're having troubles. I thought you had blocked somebody. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no. No, nobody. No. So is that everybody? Everybody has 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 participated. Yes. Uh, yes. Just Warner is missing. Warner. Yeah. Uh, okay, but you guys have asked questions. Yes, that is where we've been talking about the because uh, Luis is taking a online course uh, oh. for photo and for in photography or for I don't know how to say for photography. In photography. Ah, in photography. Okay. And uh -huh. he was explaining us to us, explaining to us about the curse. And then that is when you came in and we had the doubt and the pronunciation for shoot and shot. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Um, you guys got it though? We understand it now? Yes. Yes. I got it. I don't know if Irene has a doubt. Yes. No, I don't have any doubts. Werner, quítale el mute a tu computadora, vos. El de, te va, el de. Ah, ya lo arruinó. A saber. O porque está la teacher te da pena, vos. Él lo hubiéramos pasado primero. Al principio hablándonos en 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 italiano está. Oh, so he, so he, 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 he was able to. He was able, uh huh. Ah. So I don't know what's going on right now. Are you moving your mouth? You're, I cannot see. You're busted. <laughs> You've been busted. <laughs> Do you hear us, Warner? Yeah, I think he does. Something must have happened to his microphone. Okay, no problem. We'll wait for you. You guys just Don't keep worry. on talking, okay? You have a okay. okay. Okay, not a problem. Right. And what else? Um use the Bitcoin to uh to send the transference. And as the woman say the they uh teacher, how do you say invertir? Invest. Okay. They invest five hundred dollars in bitcoins, and in in one month they receive 
four hundred dollar, and they uh, take the four hundred and uh, yeah, how do you say dejar el dinero los quinientos dólares? Dejar. Se lo voy a decir en español. Entonces, en, estamos hablando de la cuestión del Bitcoin. Eh, una... You guys have already finished the exercise, right? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, we finished. Oh, okay, okay. We shared all that. Just checking, just checking. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. And, 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 okay. okay. I was say, I was say, I, uh, I using Bitcoin. That is the, oh. that is the, um, that is the base about our, our topic. Hmm? Okay. Okay. But you guys have talked about your, your sentences, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Okay. Good. All right. So, what is your question, Jose? It's a it's an example. List among the women. It's an it's an example because every uh, the people talk about becoming and it's good or it's bad idea. And I think if people use the Bitcoin in the uh in the, in the the best way is is it's like I use a, a credit card. If you do uh, a good um, a good use of the credit card, you can uh, buy uh, something with, with paid uh, interest. You can buy in five or six quotas in intereses. Okay, so you you would be in you would invest in, in Bitcoin? No investing is to buy something or a transfer money. No investment. That is a risk. And uh, people uh, thought about Bitcoin. And in that way, that, that is a risk to buy Bitcoins and invest in, in, in this. Okay, okay. All right, so no, so you would not risk it by investing, but you would, but you would definitely, you think that it's buying is a good alternative. Yeah, but now in our country, mm -hmm. Uh, we need to um, wait for the reglament in three months. Mm -hmm. Okay, and, but you are going to, you're going to go for it. You think it's a it's, good idea? I think it's a good idea. Okay, all right. It's an, you, option. it's yeah. an option. Okay, what do you girls think? I think we have to wait and not uh, not worry right now. Let's worry when it when it when it comes, because uh, right now nothing is going to change. So, and the dollar right. is always going to be the reference. Right. Yeah. Yeah, I I agree. For um, me, it needs to be a choice. If you want to use Bitcoin or you want you want to use dollar. And I agree with Josue, the problem is to invest, not to use it. That what? You invest, you, under your own risk, right? But mm -hmm. if you don't invest, you don't have to worry. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's, a, yeah, I, I think you're, you're right. Um, sometimes uh, worrying can make things worse, right? So you're right, sometimes we, we when you don't have all of the information, it's probably best to, you know, just just wait. Mm -hmm. Okay, you guys finished? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment then. Okay. 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 Hi guys. Hi teacher. Hello teacher. Hi teacher. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. Hello, how are you guys doing? Are we finished? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment. Okay. 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 Thank you. 
Okay, guys, welcome back. Um, all right, so I hope you guys had uh, enough opportunity to ask your classmates, to talk to your classmates about um, your, your ideas. Um, any questions, any problems that you guys had? Anything you want to ask about? No? So we understand how to make, how to work with the present progressive. To talk, to talk about things that are in progress, or, or better said, not in progress, but ongoing. Yeah? We understand how to do that, or is it still kind of like confusing? Or is it okay? Maybe specify the time that the event occur. Mm, not when the event occurs, because if we're going to specify a specific time, then we're not, it's not ongoing. The right? frequently or the regarding jury's question, I, I also have a doubt. Can we use the word at the end of a sentence, it's like for example, tomorrow? Uh, like I'm studying for my exam, uh, my tomorrow ex tomorrow's exam, I can, something like that. Can I use the time as jury is asking? No, maybe next week or something like that. Yes, you can use it, but you got to be careful because how it how it comes across. Because if, for example, um, you say, I'm studying for the exam tomorrow. The tomorrow's exam, uh-huh. Or for tomorrow's oh. exam, uh-huh. It sounds like in this moment, I'm studying for it. Mm. Right, because it's tomorrow. And that's right, no, mentira. Uh-huh, que última hora en No, no, I mean, o sea, como, it's not that it's incorrect. Like mm -hmm. grammatically speaking, it's okay. But what you're saying is I'm doing it in this particular moment. That's what you're saying. Mm -hmm. But if you, o sea, si usted quiere dar a entender that like it's an ongoing activity that continues, you wouldn't, it would not have to be, it, it couldn't be something that for tomorrow. It would mm -hmm. be something like I'm studying for my test. For my test. Next, for my um, test next month. In that case, teacher, is uh, the uh, the exam. This is an example. It is an uh, present progress. Yes. Study for tomorrow. It, it is in progress. It is in present progress. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. What I want you guys to understand is this. It's not incorrect to say that it's happening uh, right now. It, it's not incorrect to say that. I mean, grammatically speaking, it's okay. You can say that. But for the purpose of the, of the lesson that we are learning, that we're, we're, we can use the present progressive, not only for things that are happening right now, but for things that are ongoing. For that purpose, we want to show that it's not just in the moment. Right now or in this moment, it's not correct. No, it's not o sea, grammaticalmente correct. Eh, no, grammaticalmente hablando, it's correct. But what we want to do now is practice the present progressive for ongoing activities, mm -hmm. o sea, actividades que continúan, que no es solo en este momento, sino que sigue adelante. Eso queremos practicar. Mm -hmm. También, ok, ya le capté. Miri, otra duda que yo tengo. I have another doubt. Yesterday in the exercise number five, I wrote a sentence, and, but I'm using, I see that I'm using two verbs. We are planning to visit Cancun. I am using two verbs. I don't know if there is something wrong. We are planning to visit Cancun. What are the two verbs according to? Planning? 
and to visit. Okay. Um, to visit is actually not a verb. Mm. It's what we call a, a to infinitive. Ah, okay. The to infinitive is similar to the gerund. Do you remember that we talked about gerunds? Hey. I think we talked about gerunds, si no me equivoco. ING. Mm -hmm. Have we talked about gerunds not being verbs? Vamos a hablar de eso? Or no? Uh, maybe, no. no. I didn't study, maybe that was in a previous course that I. Could be. Um, anyways, gerunds are not verbs, gerunds are nouns. Ah, okay. We are talking about activities. Okay. Like when you say, I love cooking. Mm -hmm. the, the question is, what do you like? Or what do you love? What do you love? I love cooking. Mm -hmm. So what, what, el que, the thing. Mm -hmm. You're talking about a thing. Mm -hmm. So, and you can also say, I love to cook. I love to cook. So what is it that you love? To cook. So it's an activity, yeah. Ah, so and okay. so in this case, the it's not. They are not considered verbs when they are in ger gerund. It's gerund. A, a gerund or a two. Gerund. Or a ah, two okay. Three. They're not verbs. Ah, okay. Thank you. I didn't know that. Maybe that was in course two or three, <laughs> and I no, wasn't. This, or I might have gotten confused. I might have gotten confused. Mm -hmm. I thought I I had explained at some point, but. Probably not. Got it. Then now I understand. Okay, okay, thank you. All right. Thank you for asking the question. Do you guys have any other question you want to ask me? Any doubts? No? Okay. All right. It's nine o'clock. So time for our uh our attendance. So let me get that out. Okay, here we go. Um, Ana Claudia? Present teacher. Andres? Present teacher. Edgar? Present teacher. Janet. Janet. No. Fabiola. Present teacher. Uh, Heidi. Present teacher. Irene. Present teacher. Ivan. Ivan. Johnny. Present teacher, I just in, in in the class. Okay, okay, welcome. Josue. Present teacher. Uh, Juan Francisco. Present teacher. Jury. Present teacher. Carla. Present teacher. Uh, Melissa and uh, Luis present teacher Manuel Manuel no Marvin Wendy present teacher oh okay good Wendy present Werner Present teacher. I oh, see. Yay. Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, good. All right. Oh, um, let's answer. Let's answer Anna Claude's question. Uh, she was uh, Anna Claude. You had a question for Warner, right? Huh? I don't remember <laughs> the question. You you wanted to know about his name. Oh, your name is Werner or Warner? Werner. 
Ah, okay. I was mispronouncing. Okay. Uh, Werner. Werner. Okay. With an English accent. <laughs> okay. Uh, In Germany, Werner. Ah, really? It's a German name. Okay, good yes. to know. Oh, is it? Yes, I did not know that. Werner Breme is uh, the second. They pronounce the, the white Werner Breme. The so your, your name Werner is Bremer. Werner Bremer. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> 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 Marvin Pitts. <laughs> Example of the, the name. Werner, Werner Bremen. Oh, Werner Bremen. The, 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 the steam, the, the soccer. Ah. The, the soccer the football. 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 Ah, okay. I don't soccer, football. know anything yeah, about that, soccer. That's why Anna Claudia and I are like. Por eso me está. Que no sé nada de fútbol. A ver. Okay. All right. Yvonne. <laughs> Present. Okay. Welcome, uh, Francisco Javier and Jenny. Jenny? Not Jenny? Okay. All right. Okay, great. So, guys, we're going to move on. We're going to continue. Um, let me tell me, please, if you can see my screen or, sorry, my, my PowerPoint. Yes, teacher. Oh, hold on. Okay, so here we have a performance report. I have some, I have first question. What are some qualities a good manager or supervisor needs to have? So yes, we talked about a good employee. Let's talk about a good manager. Or a good supervisor. What qualities do they need to have? Make a list. Okay. And also, I want you to answer this question What do your superiors look for when giving somebody a promotion? Okay. The two questions I want you guys to discuss, or better so, not discuss, write it down. I'll give you. Um, you know, a few minutes to write down the qualities. Okay, we're looking for someone that is a manager, supervisor. Okay, and in your company, what do your supervisors look for when giving someone a promotion? Present teacher. Sorry. My, sorry. sorry, my PC is I have to reboot. Oh, it's okay. It's okay, Ivan. No worries. Is everything okay now? Uh, yeah. Okay, good. All right. So right now we're working on this. Okay, so what are some qualities a good manager or supervisor needs to have? Make a list. And what do your superiors look for when giving somebody a promotion? Thanks.
Okay, you guys ready? I think so. Yeah? Okay, all right, so we're now going to um, go back to your groups, the same groups that we had before, and you're going to share your answers, okay? So what are those qualities? And what do, what do your superiors look for when giving someone a promotion, okay? So let's go back to the, let's open up the rooms again. And this time I'm not going to give you so much time. I'm just going to give you, I'll give you about six, seven minutes. Okay. All right. So here we go. Let's open up the groups again. Oh, um, hold on. Give me a moment. Okay, and the first, um, the first question. The quality. Uh, what, what the quality of the for me oh, is empathy. Okay. Yeah, me too. Is the first, the, the first I I I put in number one okay uh, and be leadership empathy, be honest leadership to partial partial good personal relationships other yeah. other quality maybe Honesty. can be resolve conflict yes, respect Provide you coaching or? Oh, yeah, coaching. <laughs> coaching is very important. Yes. Mm -hmm. And good communication. Mm -hmm. Experience. Or no. Experience. Maybe. Um, Wait a second. Because um, uh, I don't know how to say uh, fomentar uh, uh, talking about uh, teamwork. Mm, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, maybe an ongoing improvement. Teacher, uh, you are mute. Sorry. What? Uh, you can thank you. Uh, you can say encourage, promote, foster. Uh, okay. Maybe con maybe confident too. Yes. Yes. It's okay. And. Yes. Yes. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yes. This is um. Uh, uh, I am working on the technical, technical, the chips of the florists. So I, I, the foils. 
Uh, and what do you think the managers looking someone to promote him or promote her? What the employee must have? Uh, the, I, uh, I'm sorry, repeat, uh, Chris. What do you think the managers looks in someone to promote it? Look for. Oh, I don't know if looks for. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, I I see it in in, uh, in competition. Yes, mm -hmm. uh, I visit uh, the competition, the um, uh, initiation of uh, the. ¿Cómo se dice fuerza básicas? ¿Cómo sería? Uy. Oh. <laughs> basic strength. Basic force. Strength. Or basic strength, okay. yeah. Uh, yes, uh, and we see the, the basic force uh, and, uh, and different comp competition. Force, not, not sorry, to you hear the teacher? Not, can you hear me? Guys, can you hear me or no? Basic yes. forces. Yes, I, we can yes, hear you. I don't know if uh, Werner can hear you. <laughs> I, I, I le escucho muy sojo, sorry. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Um, what I'm saying is, what am I saying? <laughs> okay, hold on. Um, of course, this is a basic strength, you say. Yeah, basic strength, not force. Strength. Uh, basic strength. Ah, okay. Strength. Perfect. Strength. No, uh, okay. <laughs> basic strength. Yes, uh, and the visit and the, um, and the basic strength and different competition. Uh, uh, I see the ability, the ability, uh, the mentally, the 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 strength, uh, psychology, is very important. Uh, Teacher, for... what will be the word appropriate to say for someone that is like a, when I explain is strong in mind? How, what will be the the word to use? Someone that is mentalidad fuerte, quieres decir, verdad, Warren? Yes. Ajá, no, mentalidad fuerte. O sea. Oh, um, o sea, si se conoce cuando alguien no fácilmente se mueve de posición, sino que es, es firme. No sé con qué es qué, qué es adjetivo se puede usar ahí. What would be the word to use? The um, teacher either strains psychologist, no? Me Maybe no, mental, mental. strong minded. Mm -hmm. Como fuerza mental, uh, for, uh, strong strong minded. mental, strong mental. What did you say, teacher? Strong minded. Uh, strong minded. Minded. Strong minded. Strong minded. 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 M I N D E D. M I N D E D. E D. Ah, okay. Strong minded. Ah. Uh, Okay, thank you. Okay, hey. are, you, are you guys finished or do you need more? Time? Oh, no, hey, we've yes, two minutes. We are still sorry. missing. Irene, okay. please. Okay, me. okay no, Irene. I'm <laughs> sorry. No, it's correct. Hey. The complete sentences or just the error? The complete sentence. Okay. Uh, sorry guys to interrupt. I just want to know, are you guys finished or do you need more time? We are mm -hmm. done. We're done? Yeah. Everybody? Yeah. Okay. Okay, good. I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment then. Okay. But continue talking. Just... <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> Recording. Class. O mejor me voy para que sigan hablando. We don't, we don't <laughs> mention about the about the homeworks. Yeah, about the that we have finish until uh, homework fifteen, right? Sorry, what is the question? Did you repeat that? Uh, uh, today we have we have to finish until homework fifteen. 
Oh, um, right. Yes. Yes, exactly. Homework 15. Uh -huh. Yes. That's what you should be doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you guys have any questions about that? About the homework 15? Um, no. No? How about you guys? You finish because already? I have a problem with uh, 13. And the reason is because I don't uh, put that. Uh, the whole sentence. Yeah, the whole sentence. Mm -hmm. The complete sentence. I just put the error. Oh, okay, okay. All right, but but now you got it. Do you understand it? Yeah, after the class, I finished the phone call. Okay, okay, yeah. All right, good. Okay. All right, I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment. Okay, teacher. En serio, quieren que me vaya? No, it's that I thought I thought we were going to leave the room right now. So. Oh, okay, okay. I'm sorry. I feel like I'm interrupting this private talk. Okay. You're right. meditating. Yeah. Okay. I'll see you guys later. Va a pensar que estamos copiando. <laughs> the leadership um hi guys are you ready I... One more time we almost finished teacher you're almost finished okay good yeah. all right continue then i'll it, continue talking imagine i'm not here okay Hi. Guys, uh, continue talking. Imagine I'm not here. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. Edward was, was okay. talking. Okay. The, the manager promotion is 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 very important. Um, responsibility and respect. Um, that uh, you can make a, a team. Uh, that a team, a team, uh, a team of work. Um, only that. Okay. This is similar. The 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 manager, uh, uh, the the quality or the the promotion. No? No necessary? Is for is similar, but the obligation is different. But wow. the the two positions uh, have a personal uh, a charge. And have uh, more responsibilities, but the manager, uh, the role is um, only uh, take the indication, and the supervisor is the, the name saying super is supervisor, no the the more person. The personal charge in my company is is similar, uh, no similar. Sorry, uh, the the manager is superior the supervisor, but okay. uh, the next uh, the next uh, step for 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 say is the supervisor and the next is manager. But uh, the two positions have a personal charge and the supervisor have much personal charge than the, the manager. For example, the mm, supervisor mm -hmm. maybe have a, a thousand, 
Yeah. Okay. Yes, yes, more or less yeah. a thousand uh, personnel at charge in my company. One supervisor. And the, one supervisor. Yes. And this the, is yes, is more personal. More person. In, in my company, one plant have a uh, three thousand. Uh, Thing. Uh, for example, 3,000 and uh, have only. Uh... Sorry, sorry, Wendy. I don't want to interrupt you, but I want to. I just want to. I want to help you with something. In my company, company is only one. Yeah. yeah yes. So you're gonna say in my my company there is, or there are, or my company has. Okay, but you're not gonna so you're gonna say my com in my company there is or there are or my company has but not my company has okay, okay. all right okay and uh, uh, 14 a uh, supervisor it's more personal I charge the supervisor what uh, what what do do you need a uh, promotion um, for super not uh, for promotion manag manager in your company uh, in my company the supervisor our manager uh, promotion is necessary uh, speak uh, English uh, full English for example, it's necessary oh, okay. because the manager uh, traveled to the USA uh, three Okay, yes, welcome. All right, so I hope you had enough time to talk to your classmates. Um, the idea here is always to um, have that opportunity of speaking you know, and talking, 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 talking. So even if you finished the task, continue talking to your classmates and asking questions. Okay, we're going to move on. Uh, we're gonna go on to the next part. Please tell me when and if you can see my PowerPoint. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. All right. So we're gonna be looking at the performance report. Oh, well, we already talked about this part. Now we're gonna look at the readers employ uh, read their employees performance report and discuss with a partner who is the best candidate for the uh, to be promoted. So we have two candidates here. Okay. The first candidate is? From Paris. Raul Perez. Uh -huh. And the second one is? What's the second one? Karen Solano. Karen Solano. Solano, that's right. Okay, so these are the two candidates or the two, the, the best contenders for the position. Now, each one of them, if you notice, has different aspects that they are evaluating. Now, the X's mean that, yes, it's good, right? Okay, so, um, and if there's nothing next to it, it's because it doesn't exist. But I want you, also want you to pay attention to the observations, okay? So there are observations there. So you're going to discuss these two people and you're going to, after reading the information, you're going to do this. You're gonna discuss, you're gonna get in there 
this guy discuss why Mr. Paris or Ms. Solano should be promoted. Support your answers. Okay. So you can say, I think blah, blah, blah should be promoted because blah, blah, blah. Okay. Got it? It's clear? Yes. Got it, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. So right now I'm going to get you guys to work in pairs. This is pair work, okay? You're going to be discussing. You're going, you're going to give your, you're going to support your ideas. Do not just say, oh, I think Ms. Solano or I, I think Mr. Perez. Give your opinion, and but also say why you have that opinion, okay? So whatever it is, there's no right or wrong answers. You just have to support your opinions. All right, so I'm going to chew in pairs. Um, there might be some groups of, some groups of three. Um, moment. Okay, um, I'm going to give you I'm going to give you about 12 minutes because I really want you guys to discuss this and give reasons, right? Imagine you are part of the promotion team, okay? You're the one in charge of promoting. And so you have to really debate, okay? So here we go. Um, 12 minutes. All right, go ahead. It's this one, isn't it? I already took my decision and I wouldn't promote any of them, none of them. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but you cannot promote someone who doesn't follow the rules, uh, doesn't have a positive attitude. Even though uh, here it says he's a leader, talking about the second one, Karen Solan. She's a leader, but she, she's, violates the rules and doesn't have positive attitude. Maybe she's a negative leader. And about Raul Perez, he's not punctual, he says, and, and he's a leader. Maybe he's a negative leader too. He's not proactive. One, one check. It's check. In, my, check. In, in the case, the Karen Solana too uh, is check. Is check, okay. Yes. Is all going punctual? No check the uh, Raúl Pérez. In the case the current Solano, yes. Oh, okay. Always punctual. Okay. Does uh, not uh, by by lot rules check uh, Raúl Pérez? Oh, the current Solano, no. It, uh -huh. Maybe uh, she violated the rules, maybe in always or sometimes. Okay. Uh, follows indication. 
check a Raúl Pérez. Ahí tenemos, sí. En Carmen Solano, tú. Um, one, one, one check, Karen Solano. Is a follow indication. Follow indication. Uh -huh. Yes. In the next live scoring group. Check, check, Raúl, uh, Raúl Pérez. Sorry to interrupt. Uh, Wendy, I sent you the question you asked me in the WhatsApp. Yeah. I sent you, I sent you the answer in by chat right now. Uh -huh. Okay, teacher. Are you going to be Yes, uh, I uh, I find I finish my the homework uh, number two the unit number one, but uh, and and I complete all 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 unit. This is a uh, number teacher is um, the assist assistant. include this is week okay but if you if you want uh after the class i can explain a little bit better ah okay okay did you okay. thank um, you right now today the person that is supposed to stay today is not in class today so ah, okay so you can stay and i will explain it okay ah, okay teacher thank you well, I the next okay day. Okay. Continue. No. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Okay, Edgar. Um, the next is focus in the responsible on is responsible. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. Is it is. Uh -huh. uh, I employ. In uh, this case, is the elect the the person less bad teacher sorry i don't i didn't understand that could you repeat in this case the uh, between the this the between two employees <laughs> is to elect to less but <laughs> select select, select to, to to less but el menos malo <laughs> okay <laughs> all right you see this is for observ observation teacher <laughs> yeah for observation is i don't know this is is employees as a car in solano the promo promo <laughs> okay <laughs> for leadership <laughs> no for a skill the leadership i i, I don't know <laughs> is the is the only quality but she usually counts late uh, ah, mm -hmm. to karen solano is is the winner <laughs> he has for 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 promote prom, promote 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 yes. are you agree werner bremen do, do you agree yes i agree do you, you agree uh, werner yes i agree okay Marvin. bernard bremen white Werner. Werner Von Braun, okay. Werner Von Braun is Von <laughs> Braun. Von Braun is a uh, on Von um, Braun. Yeah. Scientific, Cient scientific. How do you say it? Scientist. 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 Scientist.
scientist. Yes. Yeah, so. Scientist. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, okay. I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. Okay, and I I I write the the. Hi. Hi, Johnny. Hi. Hello. What happened to your partner? <laughs> She's gone. And uh, no. Uh, Make I think is she's uh, charging. Charging, charging her yeah. phone. Or what? Her phone. Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess uh, she's not charging herself, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. no. Carlita, are you there? Oh, she disappeared. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I guess she was having connection problems. Okay. All right. Um, Johnny, uh, by the way, ya que lo tengo aquí aprovechando, um, he notado que, que se está metiendo un tanto tarde. Pues, ajá. Sí. Eh, lo que pasa a veces me toca venir un poco tarde a la casa. Eh, estoy donde mis papás, eh, cuidando a mi mamá. Esperando aquí yo mi hermano. Cuando él llega, yo ya me vengo para la casa. Es a eso de 8 de la noche que yo salgo. Se me hace un poquito difícil venir. Y es donde logro conectarme. Por eso es que en, la, en esta última semana, en esta semana, estuve un poco ingresando tarde a la clase. Uh -huh. Ok. Um, y le han hablado ahí de, eh, de ¿cómo se llama? Administración. ¿Le han, ¿Le han dado alguna llamadita? Sí, me, me, al principio de esta semana, eh, bueno, de parte de Recursos Humanos en la empresa, me, me tuve que hacer una, como una carta, un correo, por medio de un correo lo mandé, eh, explicando, ¿verdad? Cuál era la, la dificultad que tenía. Y eso fue nada más. Okay. Y yo iba a, a poner de mi parte en, en conectarme a la hora. Y no faltar de aquí en adelante en las clases, porque era ya como el límite de, de asistencia que tenía. Uh -huh. Ok. Sí, porque lo que sucede es que um, hay, un, hay un requisito, ¿verdad? De, de tanto de horas como de, de, um, de horas de asistencia como de... Horas de asistencia como de... Um, la nota, nota en, 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 el, sí. en la plataforma. No sé si ya le habían comentado eso. Sí, ya, ya eh, había que cumplir cierto porcentaje en la plataforma también para... Sí, ajá, y para de asistencia. Sí, correcto. Sí. I'm come back. Hello, Carla. We thought we had lost you. Sorry, I, I have a trouble with the connection in my... But it is low. Yeah, um, Johnny was telling me that you were connecting your phone. First, he yeah. told me that you were connecting. And then I said, oh, my goodness, you, <laughs> you are, I thought you were connecting yourself. <laughs> you <were connecting> yourself. <laughs> OK. Um, OK, well, no worries. Continue working with Johnny, OK? Pretend I'm not here. OK. Jenny, can you read again the the? Yes, it sees uh, with the Scotia uh, the with before I was I was in Scotia, but Cuscatlan. We can say we can say that uh, we can say that Karen needs um needs a support with human resource to improve yes, that, yes. that problem. I agree with you, okay? Maybe she, she can change her mind. Así lo ponemos. She can mm -hmm. change. 
Mm-hmm. Change her mind. Did you guys finish? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. Perfect. I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment. Okay. <laughs> No me fijé. What? Tell no salió el cuadrito ahora. ¿Para que no salió el cuadrito de los segundos? ¿O no lo vimos? No lo viste. Estaba sí, no lo vimos. <risa> Estaba bien entretenido, cabrón. De repente apareció. Yes. De repente, de repente nos transportaron. <risa> oh, ok. Pero es verdad que sí les. Les aparecía recording, um, recording in progress. Eso sí, cuando ya nos integramos aquí, sí. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí. Solo quiero, quiero asegurarme que ayer por alguna razón se perdieron 10 minutos de la clase y no entiendo qué pasó. No se grabó. No se grabó 10 minutos. Y, y fue cuando retornando de breakout room, no. No sé, no me da, no, 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 no sé exactamente a dónde fue. Solo sé que cuando, o sea, Sé que deberían de haber habido más de, de o sea, de cierta cantidad de, de, de minutos. Y cuando voy viendo ya no estaban en esa cantidad. Es cierto, teacher. Porque Por alguna razón nomás... quizás presionó, teacher, el, el botón de grabado. Puede ser. ¿Fabio de qué iba a decir? Sí, que yo me salí cabal a las 9.59. Y estuve buscando el video para ver la tarea. <ríe> y sí, le faltaron un minuto. Al final, Fabiola. Ajá. Ah, pues tuvo que haber sido sí. después de regresar sí. del break out room. Puede ser, sí. Ajá. Cabal, eran como 10 minutos porque yo hice cabal el cálculo para que uh, cabal saliera el, el tiempo que era. Y... Sí, porque no, nos fuimos dos minutos para las 10. A... Al, al grupo y regresamos a las 10 y 8 uh -huh. Sí, bueno, bien raro, pero sí, por eso les pregunto, si en algún momento no oyen eso, por favor, díganme porque... Eh, ah, ya le gustó va a escuchar ese record <risa> ah, No, a mí no, no Al final es una herramienta porque... Uh -huh. sí. Pero sí es útil Sí, ok Sí, uh -huh. sí, muy útil muy útil Okay. All right, guys. So tell me, who would you promote? Hey. Uh, cutting. The less worse. Uh, Raul. It depends. Raul Very difficult. Perez. The position. What, 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 what's the, like, what's the difference? What, what position would you recommend Raul and which position would you recommend Karen? No one to manage the position. Okay. Why? Because, uh, because uh, I I think that she is a bad attitude. And is a like uh, is a rebel. Yeah, and Raúl uh, he, he has no uh, leadership and is not proactive. Yeah, uh, managerial position. Both of them need these qualities. How that them left. Okay. Do you guys also agree? In our case, we think that is Karen should be promoted because she is a leadership and other thing, but she has a problem with uh, doesn't have a good position in attitude, position, positive attitude in some cases. But we recommend that uh, human resource support her in improving that negative attitude in some cases. Hmm. Okay, okay. So yeah, did, did you notice that it said in some cases? 
What? Did you notice that you said in some cases, not all the time? Mm -hmm. Some cases. Just give me a moment, guys. My throat is, is getting dry and I'm, I'm okay. copyrighted. Just give me a moment. Okay. Is promote but under certain conditions. Yeah, I less bad was chosen. That's okay. right. A menos peor era ella. ¿Por qué si viola la ley? Al más no haber. Sí, es que fíjate que ninguno merecía, ¿verdad? Ninguno merecía. No. Uh, de verdad, de verdad, I, no. I mean, tú sí, tienes esa decisión, ninguno. <laughs> Vos como que seleccionás personal a ninguno, hubiera seleccionado. Other curriculum, please. Sí. Ni tampoco Wendy hubiera seleccionado a ninguno. No. <laughs> Para trabajar ahí. <laughs> Much less a promotion. No, okay. All right. Now, I understand they're not the, the best candidates in the world, but could you work with them? Like, do you think that maybe if you did something, they would be, they would get better? Just like um, Jerry said, maybe they can help them to improve. For me, it's very Raul Perez. Why? Because he has a positive attitude. And for me, this is important to encourage people in the teamwork. And you can assign him some trainings to develop the leadership skills. But Karen Solano, uh, she doesn't have a positive attitude and for example sometimes he violates the rules and you Violate. if you if you Violate. are in charge of uh, personnel uh, you have to be a, an example and for example if, if you don't follow the rules it's not a good example for you for the people that uh, you are you are in charge. Uh, you can uh, say uh, of of the the personnel that has to uh, follow the rule if you don't if you don't you don't you don't do that. Okay. Okay. All right. Good. You mentioned a word that we have a doubt in our group. Uh, violet. Uh, what is the difference with the color? pronunciation okay it's first of all it's violate violate is the one here violate. in there not okay. violet no violate late violate bio violate and it's violate. not bio it's not bio it's bio violate violet violet violate violate, violate. 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 And the Violet. color pronunciation? Violet. Violet. No. What? Repeat Violet. again? Violet. 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 You do not really pronounce the O in the color. Okay. It's not violet. It's violet. 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 The stress Violet. is in the first one. Ah, okay. And the other is violet. 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 The, the, Violet. the one for. Think about late like um the tarde. Violet. Uh -huh. Violet. Ah, okay. Violet. Violet. And, and also uh, with Juan Francisco and Josue, uh, we had a doubt uh, because we've seen sometimes broke up broke up the rules, could be used, broke up the rules instead of violate rules? No. Break the rules, not break, no, but you don't break up the rules. It's you break. Break the rules, yes. Ah, break okay. up means to separate. Ah, like, okay. a, like a couple, you can, like they, like, uh, they separated, they, they, a couple, okay. they separated, they broke up. Okay, separate. Okay. Break is, but we can use sometimes she breaks the rules. 
Yeah, break the rule. Ah, okay. Break the rule. Yeah. Sure. Break the rule, but not break up. Yes, I ah, have okay. a, I have a question. Yes. Uh, how is possible that Karen Solano violate the rules and it doesn't have warnings? I don't have an answer to that. To the observation. <laughs> I don't have an answer. I don't know. Is woman. Hey, would you have an answer? I thought you would be saying that, Ivan. <laughs> who said? <laughs> She's a woman who someone said. He's a woman. I didn't hear the question. I think it's for, for time because in some companies you can uh, stay late five or 10 minutes, but I think uh, the. Uh, it's allowed, you say? Old Perez could be uh, late for one hour or two hours more, more, more time. Maybe the, the type of, of rules. Algunos, tal vez son más graves y otros son más leves. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, exactly. Um, I guess it depends on what kind of rules. And how often. They are violated, I guess. And depends on the evaluator too, because if you see the car, it says we were looking at that in Karen says is always punctual, is marked like. Yes. But in the observation says that she usually comes late. It's not making sense, but Maybe it's a typo. You know what? I think <laughs> there is a there is a, a, a typo there. Mm -hmm. I think it should be she doesn't usually come late. And the reason why I'm saying this is because it, it, it later it says, but she does violate the rules sometimes. So there's like a there's uh, a contract. missing. There's a contract. She does. So if she does, she she violates the you rules should. because the first one is good. Do you know what I'm saying? So instead of usually, should be doesn't. Doesn't usually. Ah, she doesn't. And uh, the teacher who promote. <laughs> well. The interesting. Yeah. Um. Okay. I. I. Yeah. I. I agree that they're not the ideal candidates. Uh, I, I mean, if I had to, if there were the only two possible, like those are the only possibilities I have, okay, fine. But I wouldn't choose them as my candidates. But if they were the only candidates that I could possibly choose from, because maybe everybody else is new and I can't, I can't promote somebody that is new, right? Imagine there was a necessity of, of a promotion and everybody else is new. And these are the only two older employees. I would probably, um, I would probably promote Raul. And the reason is because as, as was already mentioned, I, uh, for me, attitude makes a big difference. Um, and the fact that he has a positive attitude tells me that he's willing to learn and to become better and then to improve. And yes, he comes, what it says here, that he has warnings and he comes, he, he usually comes late, but it also mentions that he signed up a commitment letter. So if you sign a commitment letter, that shows that he has some intention of improving right and becoming better and showing and and also the other thing is that it says he doesn't have uh leadership skills but if you train him 
maybe he can become a good leader. Maybe he just simply doesn't know how to become a leader, but he could become a good leader because, and the fact that he has a good attitude gives him the opportunity of becoming a good leader. So I think he has potential. That's what I see in him. I see potential. Not that he's the best, but I see potential. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks teacher. Yeah. So I don't know, that's just my opinion, but of course there's no right or wrong uh, answer here. I have a question about that. Um, in our company, if someone has a warning, he can be promote, promoting. Yeah, you're right about that. That's true. That is true. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's tough. I don't know. There's that. I like I said. I I, I honestly wouldn't promote any of them. To I I would I would consider them. For the future promotions. For the warning, we uh, choose uh, uh, Karen Solano. Yeah. And he has a commitment or a compromise to improve herself in uh, change the aptitude and, and punctuality. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Like I said, this is. This is uh, this is a tough teacher. Point. This is not so much a yeah. Yes, Ivan. Yeah, in in observation that Karen Solano says she usually comes late, but uh, in the list, uh, say that she is punctual. Yeah, that that's what um Anna Anna Clau was mentioning, and I said I think that there is a typing. There's a typo in the information. I think it's it should say she doesn't usually. Mm. I think I think there's a typo. So mm, that's my opinion. I think, but I don't know. But mm -hmm. yes, um, there's no right or wrong answer for this activity, right? I mean, the important thing is supporting your ideas, right? So. You would give the promotion to fulanito or minganita, but why? That, that's the important part of this activity is for you guys to say, you know, I would do it because of this, or I wouldn't do it because of this, right? That's the important part. Okay, so do you notice that on the next page, you have some questions? Um, it should look like, like this, okay? There are, there are two questions for Mr. Paris, and uh, there are five lines here to make some more questions. So it says, read the previous employees and performance report and ask and answer questions about them. So this these are some questions about Mr. Paris, and these are some questions about uh, Ms. Solano or Mrs. Solano. Again, there are seven in total, two that have been done. I want you to complete this part for homework. And then next class, we're going to be working with the partner and answering the questions. Okay? So, for example, does Mr. Mm -hmm. Paris show commitment to work? Yes, he does. Is Ms. Solana committed to work? Yes, she is. Is he a leader? Yes, he is. Does she focus on her responsibilities? Yes, she does. Okay, but right now you just just focus on the questions, only the questions. Okay, so basically you're gonna make ten questions: five for Mr. Paris, five for Ms. Solano. Got it? Yes. Okay. Right. Good. Okay, guys. So that will be all for today. I will see you guys on Monday. Don't forget that you have to do the about the um, the five homework or so five pieces of homework from this week, so that by tomorrow I will be able to update and and send the report to and support. Okay, so that's okay. it, guys. Teacher, uh, before the attendance. Yes, yes, before we're gonna do the attendance. Uh, 
who said teacher? Uh, me teacher, oh. uh, I have a question. Uh, can you explain to us the indication of the homework 15? Because uh, the, the question are in past, but I, I am trying to write uh, the answers, but uh, it didn't work. It, I, I don't know if uh, the, the question are, are, are wrong. You have to put them some because of them, are most of past. them in, in, in uh, affirmative. But yes, it's a topic we haven't seen yet here the usage of walls yes. where uh-huh some of them i they... I, I i am writing that in that way uh, in uh -huh. past uh -huh. yes i yes i was yes you were but but uh, it, 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 didn't, it didn't work yes it's yes, seen okay so yes we are talking about uh was and were here and <clears throat> okay. So if you're out, this is yes or no, this is for yes or no question. So you would say, for example, uh, was I late? I late yesterday <clears throat> were you um at the party um were <clears throat> were we um on time Were we on time? Was he tired after? Um, was he tired after class? Et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. <clears throat> so you guys know that uh, if you are, if you're asking a question with was or were, we just simply make a switch, right? So instead of saying, I was, you would say, was I. Instead of saying, you were, is were you. Instead of saying, we were, is were we. Instead of saying, he was, is was he. You guys, you guys remember that? Yes. Yes? Everybody remember yes. that? Yes. Okay, so we're always going to start with the was or the were. Okay, and after that, it's going to be the, 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 the subject, right? So in this case, I, then you, then we, and he. Okay. And then we have the sub, the, okay. the complement, right? Okay. okay. Complement. Okay. So if you want it, so you want the 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 the, the structure. It would be was or were. Plus subject. It's going to actually just abbreviate it. Subject plus complement. And we do need a complement in this one. This one's not optional. You need the complement. Okay. Um, Okay. Um, Qué emoción. Emotion. I want what are the ones that you are getting errors? And then, uh, I'm sorry, teacher. 
sorry. And uh, I, I was trying the first, the first exercise. And then uh, for the answer, for the answer you're gonna say, you're either gonna answer with yes or no, the subject and then the was or were, okay? So you can, you're going to say, um, um, yes, subject was or were. Okay. Or no subject wasn't or weren't. Okay. Okay. All right. And um, and then yeah, so that was that's what was or were, okay. Um, and the same thing goes with is or are, okay. The same thing goes with is or were. Um, so is are or am. Um, same thing. So you're going to say, for example, so you can say, is she, um, a leader? Are you, um, the supervisor? Um, am I, um, am I your partner? Okay, so again, we're going to start with, you're going to begin with the is or are because we are switching, right? Okay, so is, are, or am. And then the subject, she, you, I. And again, we're going to always need to have a complement. So this is not optional. And then it's going to, then it's going to be the same as this. Same as this is going to be over here. So is R M plus subject plus complement. And again, like I said, complement is not an option. You have to say it. And if you're going to answer, it's going to be yes, subject plus M R is or no subject. Plus, am not, aren't, or isn't. Okay. All right. So that's that's how it's gonna work. Voy a mover aquí un poquito para que lo puedan ver mejor.
Okay. All right. So um, that's it. Okay. Um, I took a little bit of time doing this because you are going to need it for your for the homework. Okay. Okay. Any Thank questions? you, teacher. You're welcome. Any questions? No. It's okay. No. Okay. Right. Only if I answer. <laughs> I just can tell you the first one is negative and the rest are positive in that way much. <laughs> okay. okay. All right, guys. So that's it, guys. I will see you Monday. Okay. Take care. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Bye bye. Thank you. Good bye -bye. night. Hey, hey, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. teacher. See you. You're welcome. See you. See you. Arvin Pitt. <laughs> Okay, Wendy. Cuénteme. Cuénteme a dónde está ese ejercicio que le puede ayudar. You have to um, turn on your microphone. <laughs> yo voy a hablar, yo voy a hablar. <laughs> Y yo como, como no le he dado la boca, ¿sabes? ¿Sabe? ¿Sabe? Ay, es que, es que, teacher, no sé, este, se me pasó por alto totalmente el ejercicio 2 de la unidad 1. Ok. Entonces, la pregunta era si todavía, si la silla podía tomárseme en cuenta. Yo ya la completé. Ya la hice. Ah, ya lo hizo. Ajá, ya la terminé. Ah, o sea, no, no, no necesitaba ayuda con eso, entonces. Bueno, no, porque aquí me puse a revisar el, el manual y, y la logré. Bueno, es porque era de ordenar las oraciones. Entonces, sí, ya la finalicé. Ah, vale, ok. Entonces, lo entendí eh, bien. Sí, 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 me la tuve buena. Ahorita lo único que, que tengo, que tengo que estoy revisando es, eh, porque ya me fui adelante en la unidad 4, eh, pero igual voy a esperar porque como no hemos recibido todavía ese último tema, creo que ahí donde estoy, no he entendido muy bien el DID. Entonces es la única que tengo mala, va. Pero eso sí, ahí la voy ¿Cuál? a dejar. ¿Cuál es eso? Es la... Es la, la tarea de la 16, la número 2. Ah, ok, sí, para la próxima semana entonces. Ajá, es que, eh, what time, creo yo que es. Pero cuando veo la estructura, la estructura me dice que es la pregunta, did y el subject. Y luego el complemento. Pero la pongo así y me sale mala. Pero mi, mi mente, o, o, o así como que la, el, la lógica para mí es what time. Pero la pongo también así y me la saca que es mala. Entonces no le quise preguntar porque como todavía no hemos llegado ahí, no sé si tiene un error la plataforma o yo me estoy equivocando. Ya le digo porque no la he revisado sinceramente. Pero ya le digo. Me dijo que la dice, ¿verdad? Ajá. Y aquí estoy buscando en, en, la, en, el, en el manual este, como la estructura con, con el, la W, pero no está. Por si cambiaba la estructura, ¿verdad? Y, y, vale. o sea, yo, ¿Cuál era? La número dos. ¿Y qué le he puesto? Yo le he puesto... Vale. En, en mi mente es... What time did she arrive? Arrive. At work. Pero... Arrive at work. Uh -huh. Pero según la... 
según la estructura, dice de qué va primero. Did, el subject, pero lo que va después es el verbo. Y time no es el verbo. Entonces el time pasaría para después. Entonces ahí para mí pierde sentido la oración. Bye. Ahorita no se complique con, con esta explicación, solo póngale como usted, como usted cree que es correcto. Ah, vale, yo le he puesto así. Y que ya probé de las dos maneras, porque en la primera que tengo buena es What did you do yesterday? Y está bien, entonces siguiendo la misma lógica, puse What did she time arrive at work? No, 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 hágalo como lo que me dijo al principio. Ah, me lo dijo, me lo dijo al principio. Ah, vaya. Me sale mal a ti, No, intenté otra vez. What did she time? No, la, no la, ¿cómo me dijo la primera vez que pensó que era? What time? She... Que pongo mal. What time did she arrive at? What time she did? No, sorry. No, así. Es what time did? She arrive, arrive. work. Me la tira mal a teacher. Y al final le pongo el signo de pregunta y le pongo la W. Me la voy a enseñar. Ajá, compárteme. Ajá. Mire. Vea eh, si tiene un espacio al principio. ¿No? Mm -mm. Lo, lo puede hacer más grande. ¿Posible? Sí. Ok. Ajá. ¿Y lo, lo que sigue? Mire. No tiene que espacio. Y aquí no tiene. Inténtelo una vez más, o sea, a ver. Voy a volver a escribir todo. Ajá. Mm, no, así no. Se no lo había puesto. <risa> What time did she did she Mire, teach. Más que me maltrata esto. ¿no? Qué raro. <laughs> Ah, que sí, muy de claro. Yo trato, trato y no lo consigo como la canción. Pero usted sí se lo acepta, dicha en su plataforma. No, o sea, yo estoy viendo la respuesta. Ah, estoy viendo la respuesta. Y entonces, teacher, ¿qué pasó aquí? ¿En qué será que estoy exponiendo? Pero no estoy poniendo nada malo, ¿verdad? Wap time. Sí, ¿por qué? Sí, será alguna que vaya mayúscula y yo no la pongo. Sí, no, ¿verdad? Sí. Arrive lleva doble R. At work con al final de pregunta. Es que mire, es que yo estaba, es que yo sabía que así era, pero como me la tiraba que no, dije, entonces voy a ir por la estructura, va. Sí, porque, vaya, se lo, 
Les voy a compartir ahorita. Miren, eso es que a mí me sale. Ah, esa es la respuesta. Sí, es la respuesta. Entonces, ay, no. Ay, por eso no entiendo, porque mire, aquí está. Aquí está. Ajá. The answer. Esto es lo de, como me sale en la plataforma. Ajá. Sí, cabrón. Ok, ha hagamos un, una prueba. Ponga el espacio. ¿A dónde está el espacio? Al principio ponga el espacio a ver si tal vez por qué motivo pusieron un espacio ahí. A veces es loco y la plataforma de repente. No, mire. Dice que está malo siempre. Siempre digo que está malo. Qué raro. ¿Sabe qué? Intente en otro dispositivo. En... Tiene otro dispositivo, ¿verdad? ¿Dónde podría intentarlo? Solo que en el celular. Ah, intente en el celular. Y a ver. Tal vez por X motivo no se lo quiere agarrar en ese dispositivo. No tiene lógica eso. Yo nunca me he metido de otro, otro lado, pero ya ver. Y me furula este lado. Sí, porque, o sea, esa es la respuesta. Usted ya lo pudo comprobar y lo tengo. Y entonces, Tiki, ¿qué quiere de mí eso? <risa> no. <risa> No sé, ahí sí. Entiendo, sinceramente. Nunca había visto eso. Ve que, que, que ahí a veces ando algo perdida, pero hoy sí me, 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 cuando a veces hago las cosas, me, me, me enfoco. Ahí enfoco. Ver ese de <risas> tarea 16. Ah, mira, aquí me abrió aquí mismo. Mira, esa cosa es mágica. Aquí mismo donde estaba en la compu me abrió la, la plataforma. Vamos a ver. Wow. Es como la donde iba el right now. Fíjese que la, pre, la respuesta del anterior también usa right now. Entonces ahí me confundí yo. Porque arriba sí lo usa y abajo no. Tucha. No, me sale errónea también aquí en el teléfono. ¿En serio? Sí, mire. Y le puso también. Sí, le puse el, el, el signo de pregunta al final. Ah, ve, ve. ¿Qué onda? Pues sí, pues, sí es que se me agarró porque realmente no, no, no le hay. Quizás la plataforma no. Déjenme hacer, voy a hacerlo yo. Escribir. Lo único que se me ocurre es eso de quizás hubo un espacio.
ponga un espacio al final de la de, de... antes del signo de pregunta no después no sé si se podrá no <risa> se puede sí se puede pero no 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 sale mal al siempre De hecho, ya le puse uno también antes del signo de pregunta, por si tal. No. No, no le hay. ¿Sabe qué? Mejor voy a, voy a consultarlo. Porque, porque lo, lo muy interesante es que acabo literalmente de copiar la respuesta. Acabo de copiar la respuesta para ponerlo como respuesta. Si no sé si me, me capta. Ajá, sí, sí. Lo copié, copy paste y me sale error. Ajá. Entonces no, no, no tiene sentido eso. Porque si, si yo copio la, la pregunta, la respuesta, en teoría el, debería de ser la misma. Sí, pues, sí. Si hay espacio o algo, ahí tendría que estar copiado y pegado. Ajá, es que sí, bien raro. Uy, está feo esa. Qué feo esa cosa. Verdad que sí. Sí, porque se para del éxito, ya ve. Qué raro de pronto. Nunca había visto esto. Había visto cosas raras en la plataforma, pero. Pero no, sí. Y mire que por eso tengo el 96% nada más. Sí. Sí, che. Y la otra pregunta era el porcentaje que me dio es la asistencia. ¿Esa asistencia ya está tomada la de ahora? No. La semana. No, es, es de acuerdo a lo que se ha tomado hasta, hasta ayer. Y quiero ver si me va a pegar, si no falta ningún día la otra semana, a ver si me pega el 80. Sí, sí. Bueno, porque ajá, están todos calculados. Ya los ahorita estoy viendo, está todo calculado de acuerdo. A, no hay ningún día que no hayan calculado. Porque un día de eso vi que todavía no habían calculado un día, pero, pero sí, no, ahorita es, hasta donde veo son para el día. Han calculado todo. Solo faltaría la de hoy. So, en teoría son 6 por 6, 6, ¿cómo es cómo, cómo la cosa? 6 por 5, 30. Son 30 puntos todavía. 30, 30, ajá, 30 puntos que todavía se puede subir. O sea, tengo 50 ahí. Ay, más que se quedó allá en el chat. Sí, va. Ah, sí, bueno. Pero, Cuenta. Pero tiene 30 puntos todavía que poder subir porque son 5 por día y faltan, faltarían lo de la próxima semana, o sea, todo lo de la semana próxima que son 5 días más ahora, son 6, entonces 6 por 5 son 30. Entonces usted podría, podría llegar al 80 y algo. Ajá, 80. Pero tiene que conectarse todos los días y a la hora. Ajá. Sí, dicho. Ok. Ah, pues eso sería todo, Wendy. Ahí voy a consultar porque sí está, está raro. Eso sí, sí. Le digo ahí sí, sí. No sé, bien raro. Eso ahí sí. Sí topó. Topé, creo ser. Ahí sí topé. Así Bye. que voy a consultarlo. Ok. Perfecto, dice muchas gracias. Uh, you're welcome, Wendy. Take care. Gracias. Pasa buenas noches. Nada. Bien. Adiós.